Hey, what's up guys? I'm Lan here. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about Apple ecosystem. So this video is going to be a bit different from the videos that you see regularly on my channel. Not going to talk about iOS, not going to show you some updates on iPhone or rather talk about some of the features of iOS. Rather, I'm going to talk about the whole Apple ecosystem. So basically in this video, I'll just try to simply explain what exactly Apple's ecosystem means and what are the Apple products that I personally do use in day to day life and how do I take the benefit of Apple ecosystem. So basically, if you are interested, if you like what I do, basically give this video a thumbs up and also I would request you to subscribe to the channel as it gives me a lot of motivation to make this kind of videos for you guys. And with that being said, let's get right into the video. As I said in the beginning of the video, I'm going to talk about Apple ecosystem, basically what Apple ecosystem means and also how personally do I take the benefit of the Apple ecosystem. So uh, probably you have seen on my videos that I have an Apple Watch Series 3. Also, I do personally own a MacBook Pro and I do basically own a, an iPhone 10 R. So basically, uh, although I don't have AirPods and iPad and stuff like that, but still I'm able to kind of use the Apple ecosystem. So firstly, I'm going to talk about what exactly Apple ecosystem means. What do you mean by Apple ecosystem? So basically, if you have multiple products, from Apple let it be iPhone iPad MacBook or Apple watch or maybe AirPods or something like that so you can take the benefit of the ecosystem so basically what ecosystem means you know you can walk parallelly on different devices different softwares would run parallelly on your devices let's suppose you are you know uh, doing something doing some research on your iPad or maybe on your iPhone on Safari web browser the moment you open your MacBook Pro and try to you know continue to do the research on your Safari browser on your MacBook Pro or you don't have to again you know start from the scratch all those websites will be opened up automatically so that is that is the power of Apple ecosystem so this is not basically restricted to that so uh, in this video basically I'm gonna talk about how do I personally take the benefit of the Apple ecosystem so as I said before I do own a MacBook Pro and an iPhone so basically it helps me a lot in my video production so right now I'm shooting with a DSLR sort of what I'm gonna do I will transfer all the footage from the DSLR to my iPhone and once the you know all the footage are present in my iPhone so basically I'll have to transfer all the footage from my iPhone to MacBook so basically I'll just uh, you know take the benefit of airdrop so airdrop is a feature uh, you can say on uh, any of the Apple devices if you have multiple devices you can send uh, you know gigabytes of file within seconds uh, what I shoot on with my DSLR so if the size is 1 GB or more than 1 GB so it takes you know 30 to 20 seconds probably to transfer all the files my iPhone to MacBook Pro so this is the way kind of I take the benefit of Apple ecosystem mostly apart from that I use my Apple watch as you can see right here it's a series 3 watch uh, quite an old watch that I have been using for more than a year and you can also take the help of this you know watch as well so uh, most probably I will tell you some of the features about this Apple watch so basically if you're having an Apple watch notification management is the most powerful thing that you can do you know that you can do with your Apple watch maybe you are working maybe you're, you're busy working with some project but you're getting tons of notification on your phone so every time you don't want to look in your phone every time when you, your phone chimes so you know you don't have to reply or need to reply apply to all those text message or uh, the notifications that you're getting so probably if you're getting an important notification you can set in custom alert and at the same time put your phone on silent and just you know have a glance at your apple watch and you know you can uh, manage the notifications very easily apart from that apple watch will also help you to unlock and you know lock your macbook or ipad if you're using that at the same time i'll talk about one more feature that i personally use so this is an iphone so there's a, a setting called you know uh, you can you can you can take the phone calls from your uh, other apple devices so as i'm having a macbook pro although this macbook pro doesn't have a cellular connection but if somebody calls me i can take either from my macbook pro or from my iphone let's suppose my iphone is there at the table and i'm working in front of my laptop i just want to take the call uh, from the macbook pro at the same time my macbook rings and using my macbook speaker i can take the call and i can you know 
talk to the person who is calling me so this is the kind of benefits that i personally take with apple ecosystem and i just wanted to share with you guys what exactly you know the apple ecosystem is and if you are having an iphone or probably any other devices you can you know start using the apple ecosystem benefit so i wanted to uh, you know uh, share my experience how do i personally get benefited out of apple ecosystem and also probably thinking of getting an ipad so you can uh, you know i can start using the sidecar features so you know i do mostly my video editing stuff on my macbook pro so probably i can use my ipad as a second screen so just planning to get an ipad so i hope you like this small video I wanted to share with you guys my apple ecosystem experience so let me know in the comment section uh, whether you are using or taking the benefit of apple ecosystem how many products of apple you are owning and if you are using an uh, apple watch series 3 exactly how you are using or taking the benefit of your apple watch so let me know those things in the comment section and i hope you like the video if you do like the video give this video a thumbs up and again i will see you on my next video Bye.